On today's Toy Spot, we're having a look at the Playmates Toys Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Giant 11-inch Raphael. What's there to really say about an 11 inch turtle other than how freaking cool is that? I mean, yes, these aren't going to be catered to, you know, all collectors out there, but definitely the kids that are wanting a large version of their favorite turtle, this is right up their alley. Down below, there's a picture of Raphael and it says, warning, choking hazard, small parts not recommended for children under three years of age. This comes to us from the folks over at Playmates. If we spin around the back of the box here, you can see all four turtles respectively covered in the 11 inch versions. We've already had a look at Leonardo, but there's also Donatello, Raphael, and Michelangelo. Your read up says they were born in shadow, they live in shadow, and they fight in shadow. New York City crime rates are on the rise, and innocent civilians tremble in fear. But there's also a force fighting back, vigilantes among us, ready to protect the city. Are they the heroes we expect them to be? And are they powerful enough to take down the masked warrior everyone fears, the Shredder? Uh, be sure to head over to www.playmatestoys.com. You can check out the basic class figures that we've been having a look at, as well as these incredible 11-inch uh, versions of the Turtles 2. Having said that, Spot's going to take a break. I'm going to get this out of the packaging, and when we come back, we're going to get a better look at the giant 11-inch Raphael. Don't go anywhere, guys. There's more heading your way. Stay tuned. As with his smaller, basic version of Raphael, the larger Raphael does come with his own pairs of size, although extremely large versions of size. Uh, just by a funny comparison, the giant size for the 11 inch Raph, and there's the little smaller size that would have come with the basic class version of, of Raph. So you can see really just from size alone, how, no pun intended, the sheer size of the larger ones versus the smaller ones. Now with the size, he does hold them in his hand, but unlike Ra uh, unlike Leonardo, there is no section, like the basic class version of Raph, there's no section anywhere that you can have him holding the size, at least when they're not in his hands. Uh, but you can take them, and uh, they, they fit in his hands. There's a little less give, I think, putting the size in their hands in the larger versions than the smaller basic versions. And it's just because the plastic that they use is a little denser, especially around the, uh, the finger area there. But there you have Raphael holding his size. And once again, there's the basic version of Raphael. Just to kind of show you how much taller and how much bigger these turtle toys are. Uh, Raph, I'd say, clears really what, almost his waist, maybe about mid-thigh, uh, versus how much taller the 11-inch Raph is. Uh, he really towers over the smaller basic figure. Also showing you the difference in details too. Uh, his mouth is much more open in the 11 inch version of Raph versus the basic figure of Raph. And also the pupils, a little more movie accurate, the pupils have been painted in on the 11 inch version versus that of the basic version. And for your comparison between the two turtles, here's the Leonardo that we've already had a look at versus the Raphael. Coloring, a little bit different. Leonardo has a much lighter green color, same as he did with the basic version of, of the figure. Raphael's a much darker color. Um, but Raphael, though, is a much beefier looking turtle, even really to the 11 inch version as well. Raph's bigger in the arms, the legs, and his torso versus that of Leonardo. And you can kind of even see on the side how Raph is just a much beefier looking version uh, compared to, to, to Leonardo. Despite the size, Raphael still is fairly articulated. Uh, his head does rotate left and right, up and down via a ball joint here. In fact, his head actually moves a little bit better uh, because of the gap, the gap right here. His head moves a little bit better than the basic version of Raph did. I think there's a little more clearance. Uh, equally so, his shoulders are on hinge sockets, so they move out, uh, forward and back and out. Swivel in the wrists, which is actually the one thing that the basic figures didn't have. He has no waist swivel, though his legs do go forward, back, out, and he also has a hinge and rotation in the knee. 
Um, so yeah, still pretty articulated figures, just a lot bigger. What I really like that Playmates is doing with this particular line is that they're giving us turtle toys specific to the kind of collectors that are out there. Uh, some collectors probably would just be content with picking up a basic version of the figure, nice, small, compact size, of nicely articulated, and something you can just sit on the shelf. On the other hand, though, you probably, there are still going to be kids out there that want a really large version of their favorite turtle. Uh, if there are kids out there that really love Raphael as, as their particular turtle, then the 11-inch version of Raph is something that you're going to want to take to school with you, that you can play out outside with your, your friends, and each one of your friends could have their own large size turtle. So I think this is definitely a turtle figure that is geared towards more the kids. The kids are really going to love a big, big version, a big, giant version of the Ninja Turtles. Today's toy spot, we were having a look at the Playmates toys, giant 11 inch, 11 inches of Ninja Turtle action. We're having a look today at Raphael. Don't go anywhere guys, spot's still gonna have reviews of more Ninja Turtle toys heading your way. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.